Hey guys, welcome back to another review. And today I have for you guys a really cool dragon figure. This is the Russian figure Dimitri that was released in 2003. And this figure is really, really cool. So let's get started by showing you the box. Alright, World War II, Sevastopol 1942. This guy is part of the Soviet Naval Infantry Black Sea Fleet. There's the figure. Uh, looks really, really cool there. Really like the background picture. Very nice. Alright, back of the box. There's some of his cool equipment that he comes with. As I said, this figure was released in 2003. Alright, there's the box. Very cool as always. Here is the figure. Alright guys, this is an awesome dragon figure. Uh, the Russian figures are always uh, very cool and very well made. And this one in particular is very cool. Um, I don't have many uh, sailor figures, uh, so this guy is just uh, awesome. I really, really like him. I got him off eBay for uh, $60, so um, definitely a little pricey, um, but this figure is very rare and is generally very expensive, so um, uh, he's just really cool, though. Comes with some awesome equipment. All right, let's take a look at his uh, weapon here. Got a really, really cool rifle. It is a Soviet SVT-40 rifle, um, but he holds that really well. All right, here the rifle is. Um, I really like this model. It's very cool. Got a nice strap on there. Okay, there's the magazine, and you can pull this back, see the bullet inside, very nice detail, and the sights can come up. Overall, this is a very nice, good quality rifle, I really like this one a lot. <clears throat> Alright, the figure also comes with some nice little accessories here. He has a cigarette lighter and also a cigarette, which uh, you can put in his fingers here to get a cool look there. That's very nice. <clears throat> Alright, let's take a look at his head sculpt. And his awesome uh, fleet cap that he's got on there. That just looks fantastic. Alright. That is really cool. Love the Red Army symbol there. and oh, This is really cool here. Uh, this, uh, I guess it's called a tally. It goes around the cap. Uh, that looks really cool. Got some great details on that. Okay, here's the head sculpt. This is a very cool looking head sculpt. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Alright. As for accessories, this guy comes with some pretty neat stuff here. In particular, I love his... Uh, Ammunition bandolier goes around his chest. Looks very cool. Uh, the only thing I don't like is in the back. It's very difficult to get these to uh, strap on. They're a little loose, so you kind of just have to bunch them together. Uh, it looks a little messy, um, but the front uh, that just looks fantastic. Love the way that looks. 
But uh, let me take those off. All right, that's just uh, really, really cool. Uh, next up, we got his gas mask uh, bag here. Take that off. Very nice. Okay, here's his other ammunition belt. All right, on his belt, he's got a few other accessories here. Got a little pouch there, which is really cool. It's like leather material. It looks very nice. Um, we have two frag grenades here, stick grenades. Very cool. Also got a knife with a sheath. And got some more pouches here. And we have a canteen with its holder. All right, let me take off this belt. Let you have a look at that. Now, this is a pretty cool belt. I like the uh, insignia in the front, the anchor there. Uh, that's really cool. And also, I like the leather. Uh, it's very nice. All right, as for his uniform, uh, this is a very cool looking uniform, uh, sailor uniform. Uh, we got some little Red Army insignias on both sides of his arms. It's very nice. Um, I like this back here. That's really cool. And uh, underneath, he does have another shirt. It's like a striped black and white shirt that he's got on. Um, I won't take this off. It's uh, kind of a pain to take off. But uh, you can kind of see what that looks like underneath. Okay, we just have same colored pants here. And uh, some really cool looking boots there. That's very nice. Great detail. Alright guys, so that is the Russian figure, Dimitri. Super happy to have this figure in my collection. He's very hard to find and is usually pretty expensive, but uh, uh, definitely worth the purchase. So definitely worth um, checking this figure out, guys. Definitely recommend him. Thanks for watching this video, and um, I'll see you next time.